Welcome to the Mbox Listening Challenge. So we've been getting a lot of positive reviews and feedback on the all-new Mboxes. And um, we've also heard from our customers that you guys want to hear the Mbox compared to some of the other stuff on the market. We know that's kind of hard for our customers to do. So we wanted to create that opportunity for you. So what we've done is we've taken some of the great products on the market with four built-in mic preamps and similar features, but that are three to six times more expensive than Mbox Pro. And we put them all to the test. We put them all in the studio together, running on different systems, so you can really hear for yourselves how the Mbox stacks up to the competition. Avid asked me to come down and take a look at their testing scenario for this, this shootout. You know, not everybody has the opportunity to have a manufacturer send them two or three units and check them out in their own studio. So that's why I think this test that we're doing now is super valuable because somebody may not have the time or the ability to even do that. Part of what we did was measure the audio performance of each of these interfaces and while that's very telling, what's really important is how they sound. So the challenge when doing a shootout like this is to create a level playing field to give everyone an objective listening experience. In order to do that, it's really important that we clock everything independently that we get everything calibrated to within a tenth of a dB, and that we create a signal path that's completely neutral. So we started with a single source, blue Dragonfly microphone going through a custom Dave Hill split with uh, the high-end Jensen transformers to create an exact signal going to each of the four interfaces. Uh, each of the boxes levels were matched using an AP2700 to make sure that we were recording at the exact same level. So by doing this, I think we've created the closest apples-to-apples -apples comparison that we could for each of the interfaces. We've gone you know, way beyond what any normal person would, would do to, to ensure that this thing is like a, a very accurate test. So to make things more interesting, we decided we wouldn't use Pro Tools for the shootout. The Mboxes work with everything now, so we thought, let's use Logic. What immediately struck me is that I had a very, very difficult time telling the difference between the interfaces. And considering the price range between the four interfaces, um, I have to say I'm extremely surprised. So again, the point of this is to give you guys an opportunity to hear Mbox in the context with other products on the market. There's a lot of great stuff out there, and you need to decide for yourself what you think is best for you. So take the listening challenge, and you be the judge.